Welcome to Exams Daily YouTube channel. Today I am going to share with you about the latest and important current affairs of December 25. Before that, don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and click the bell icon for daily updates. National Affairs Union Social Justice Minister launches Swachata Abhinayan mobile app. Union Minister for Social Justice and Empowerment Tavachan Gelak launched Swachata Abhiyan mobile app. This app is launched to seek the help of NGOs, social organizations and general public for collection and compilation of the data. This app has been developed to identify and geotag the data of sanitary lanterns and Manual scavengers, state affairs. Kerala state government and UN women partnered for country's first gender data hub. UN women and the Kerala government have partnered to launch India's first gender data hub. The objective of this data hub is to collect, analyze, and use more nonced data and to inform policy formulation in the manner that will center stage women's right. The agreement was signed between officials of UN Women's and Kerala State Government. Collaboration will broaden and deepen various pioneering initiatives for gender equality and women empowerment. Chief Minister of Kerala is Pinarayi Vijayan. Governor of Kerala is Arif Mohammad Khan. MOUS and Agreements Indian Army and Bank of Baroda Inc's MOU for Baroda Military Salary Package for Army Personnel. Indian Army and Bank of Baroda have signed a Memorandum of Understanding for Baroda Military Salary Package. The MOU was signed by LT Gen Ravin Kosala DG and Vikramaditya Singh Kichi, Executive Director, Bank of Baroda. This package includes Free personal accidental insurance cover, permanent total disability cover, partial disability cover and air accident insurance cover of sizable amounts. Headquarters of BBOB is located in Vadodara, founded on 20 July 1908. Banking Affairs Indian Government and World Bank signs agreement worth $500 million for highway projects. Government of India and World Bank has signed an agreement worth $500 million to provide safe and green national highway corridors in four states of the country. The four states are Rajasthan, Andhra Pradesh, Himachal Pradesh and Uttar Pradesh. Under this Green National Highways Corridors project, the Ministry of Road Transports and Highways will be constructing 783 kilometers of highways. ICC Banks launches Infinite India platform. ICC Bank has launched a new online platform named Infinite India. It is an initiative for providing a one-stop solution to foreign entities. It provides all pre- and post-services for setting a business entity under one roof along with tailor-made banking solution for foreign entities. CEO of ICC Bank is Sandeep Pakshi. Headquarters of ICC Bank is located in Mumbai, founded on June 1994 in Vadodara. Appointments Vinit Agarwal appointed as new association president succeeds Niranjan Hiradandi. Vinit Agarwal has been designated as the new president of the Associated Chambers of Commerce and Industry of India. He is managing director of Logistics Major Transport Corporation of India Limited. He succeeds Niranjan Hiradandi, co-founder and MD Hiradandi Group of Companies. President of Asuchamis Chamas, Vinit Agarwal, headquarters of Asuchamis, Chamas, located in New Delhi, founded on 1920. Awards and Honours U.S. President confers Legion of Merit to PM Narendra Modi. The President of United States conferred the Legion of Merit to Prime Minister Narendra Modi. The award was received by the Ambassador of India to the U.S. Taranjit Singh Sandhu on behalf of the Prime Minister. The Legion of Merit is a military award of the United States. It is given for exceptionally meritorious conduct in the performance of outstanding services and achievements loyalty.
ATP 2020 awards announced Novak Djokovic emerged as the player of the year the association of tennis professional awards announced for the year 2020 Novak Djokovic becomes 2020 ATP player of the year 2020 award for sixth time coach of the year 2020 award won by Federico Vincenti Mate Pavic and Bruno Sous won the double team of the year other winners Tim Gullikon carried coach award is Bob Breed most improved player is Andrey Rublev newcomer newcomer of the year Carlos Alcaraz comeback player of the year is Vasik Pospisil ATP tournament dot fans favorite is Roger Federer ATP tournament dot com fans favorite team Jamie Murray and Neil Skubci defense news India successfully conducted Maiden launch of army version of medium range surface to air missile defense research and development organization has successfully launched the medium range surface to air missile army version from integrated test range Chandipur Odisha army version of MRSAM as a surface to air missile developed jointly by DRDO India and IAI Israel for use of the Indian army the MRSAM has been manufactured by Bar Dynamic Limited India DRDO is founded on 1958 headquarters of DRDO is located in New Delhi Defence Secretary Ajay Kumar launches NCC Digital Forum the Defence Secretary Dr Ajay Kumar launched the DNNCC Digital Forum The aim for launching this digital forum is to provide a platform to the national cadet corps cadet all over the country to share their experience of various NCC activities. The forum will be hosted on the DGNCC website. Sports Affairs Union Sports Minister inaugurates 8 Kilo India State Centers of Excellence across India. Union Minister for Sports Kiran Riju has inaugurated Eight Kelo India State Centers of Excellence in India. The Kelo India State Centers of Excellence are being started in addition to the National Centers of Excellence. The eight states are Manipur, Arunachal Pradesh, Mizoram, Kerala, Telangana, Nagaland, Karnataka, and Odisha. Now we have to see the important days. Good Governance Day 2020 is celebrated in 25th December. Good Governance. Day is celebrated annually on 25th December the anniversary of the birth of former prime minister Atal Bihari Vajpayee this day was founded in 2014 to honor Mr Vajpayee by raising awareness among the citizens of government accountability these are the latest things of December 25 do follow our exams daily youtube channel for daily updates like this thank you 